the polls have closed in New Hampshire's first-in-the-nation presidential primary, and self-described Democratic Socialist Bernie Sanders has taken the early lead as he fights to establish frontrunner status in the race, and the Democratic Party hopes for some stability. Following last week's mismanaged Iowa caucuses, the Fox News Decision Desk reports that former South Bend, Indiana, Mayor Pete Buttigieg is currently in second behind Sanders, and a late surging Minnesota Senator Amy Klobuchar is in third. Neither former Vice President Joe Biden nor Massachusetts Senator Elizabeth Warren appears poised to finish in the top three positions according to the Fox News voter analysis. The early signs were especially disappointing for Warren, a known quantity in the New England political world who had long pulled ahead of Klobuchar nationally. With 51% of precincts reporting, Sanders had 27.2% of the vote, Buttigieg 23.4%, Klobuchar 19.6%, Warren 9.5%, and Biden 8.4%. Sanders defeated Hillary Clinton by more than 20 percentage points four years ago in the state. In an apparent acknowledgement that that he was in for a rough night, Biden already left the state hours before polls began closing at 7 p.m. ET. The rest of the polling sites closed an hour later. As the night wound on, Biden addressed his supporters in New Hampshire via live stream from South Carolina.